All right, who's ready to get moving and grooving? We're gonna change up our warm up today. I wanna try something new. Um, give me feedback on if you like it or if you like our old warm up. Um, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, so, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with a forward heel. Just getting our arms moving. Arms are just swinging back. I'm opening and closing my hands. Just get everything moving. All right, now we're taking it to the side. Arms stay about the same. Think your arm, it's like you have water on your hands and you're just flicking that water off. So we're trying out a new warm up that's a little bit more dynamic to see if you all like it. You feel a little bit more warm and are ready to get moving and grooving with our stations. And let's head back. So you're gonna step back. Arms are flicking back now. So making a fist and flick. So we're gonna go through this one more time. We're gonna do 20. So I want you counting with me using your loud voice. All right, let's get started. So with our heel, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now we're going out to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. We're going back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Let's march it out. So getting those arms moving. So trying to let's get those knees up a little bit higher, getting our arms swinging. And next we're gonna do a side step with a reach. So it's gonna look like this. We're gonna reach, big hand reach out, reaching um, low, and then we're gonna weight shift, go the other way, opening up through our chest. Let's do 20 of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Back to marching. Get those arms moving, get your knees up. Next, we're gonna warm up with some squats. So we're gonna squat, and then open up big through our arms. This is in replacement to our stand-ups and sit-downs. So we're gonna do 25 of them. All right, let's get our feet wide. All right, we're gonna squat it down. Stand up, open up through our chest. That's one, 
two, three, four, keep your fingers big, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, give me five more, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, and twenty-five. Let's march it back out. Get your arms moving, getting your knees up. So next, what we're gonna work on is just doing some trunk rotation. So just like with our warm up, um, where you have a target behind you and you have me, we're gonna do that same one. So let's get our feet apart, arms up. So we're gonna come, um, turn back, come back to center, and then we're gonna go the other way. So that's one, we're gonna do 15 of these. Other side, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, keep your arms strong. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. 15, and we're back to marching it out. All right, so stations today, we're gonna have our hand weights. Let me talk you through our stations before we get going. So the first one, you're gonna have your weights, and we're gonna do a squat with a press. Next, you're gonna drop your weights. We're gonna go on to the chair, floor, or wall. We're gonna get into a plank. We're gonna work on coming down onto our elbows, pushing back up. Next, we're gonna work on our arm circles. So we've done this in the past. So one is going forward. I always have to think about this. If one's going forward, then the other is going backwards. So we're working on opposite circles. And then next you'll grab your weights again. We're gonna have our arms up and we're gonna work on marching, bringing your elbows in and out. Okay, next is gonna be a side step with a tricep kick back. Side step, kick back. You can do both, or you could just do that one side, or to really spice it up, you can do opposite. Next, you can do it with weights or no weights, and we're gonna work on some cross punches. So really working on getting some oomph and getting some nice turns.
turning, grabbing your weight. Next is put away the dishes. So squat up, put away the dish, squat, put away the dish. Next is our, bring your leg up, arms come out to the side. And you can add in a squat to the center of this. And then we're gonna do some hooks. And I'm gonna, so a hook, hook. And I'm gonna call out right or left. So right, right, left, left, right. So those will be our stations. We're gonna do a minute of them, go through them twice. Um, and then we'll do some balance work and a cool down. All right, let's grab our weights and get going. So we're starting with our squat and then an overhead press. All right, let's go. So we're squatting down, push it up, down, up, down, up. Really trying to reach for the ceiling. Make sure you're breathing. When you're squatting, it's like you're getting down to sit down into a chair. Give me 15 more seconds. Let's do one more. All right, 15 second break. And then we are doing our planks. So you can be in a plank or you can do a blank coming down onto elbows. All right, let's go. So coming down to elbows, push it back up, down, Back up, down, back up. If that feels like too much, you can just hold here at the plank. Give me 20 more seconds. Okay, one more. All right, come back to center. We have a 15 minute um, time off. Next is our arm circles. So you're gonna have one arm be going forward. The opposite arm is going backwards. All right, let's get started. And the bigger you can make this, the better. You can vary up the speed. As you're doing this, really focusing on standing tall. Give me 10 more seconds. All right, shake it out. Woo! Grab our weights. And our next station is gonna be that march. 
bringing our arms in and out. So let's get arms in position, elbows are up. So we're marching in, bringing it out. So we are really working shoulders today. Give me 30 more seconds. All right, Woo. shake it out. We get 15 second break. For this one, we're working on our side step with a tricep kick back. Bring it in, kick back. You can either do a toe tap, you could do a lift, you could do a side step, your choice. Let's go. So we're really working on squeezing the back part of our, our upper arms. We're working on that weight shift. Try not to use momentum. Squeezing your tush too as you're taking that step. Got five more seconds. All right, put the weight down. Next is cross punches. So we're gonna do cross, bring it in. Other side. I want you to have a target that you are reaching to. All right, let's get going now. So you're crossing, bring it in. Really trying to get some oomph. Give me 30 more seconds. Fifteen to go. Making sure you're getting to that target each time. All right, let's walk it out. Grab one weight, and we're gonna work on putting away the dishes. So we're gonna reach down, put it up. All right, let's get going. Reach it down, up, bring it down, up. Give me 20 more seconds. One more to go. All right. Let's grab our weight. 
in between stations. Let's keep moving. And we are going to do our side arms with a side leg lift. All right, let's get going now. So lift, bring it in, lift. You can be here too. Or you could, if you're using a chair for support, you can just be here. Full out is here. Give me 10 more seconds. All right, let's put our weight down. We got one more station to go and then we've done one round of it. So let's keep it moving. And so this is gonna be our hooks. I'm going to call out either right or left. All right. So standing tall, get your arms ready. Let's go. Right, 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 left, left, right, left, 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 right, right, left, right. Right, 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 left, 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 right, right, left, right, left, right, 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 left, right, left, right, right, left, 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 left. Left, right, 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 left, 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 right, left, 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 right, 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 left, right, right, left, right, 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 left, right. Give me 10 more seconds. Right, left. Left, right, right, left, right, right, left. All right, shake it out. Get a sip of water. You've made it through the first round of stations. You're doing awesome. All right. So let's keep moving during this break. We had, we're going to start back at the top. So it's going to be a squat with an overhead press. All right, we're going to start in 15 seconds. You all are doing awesome. All right, let's get into position. So we're squatting down, getting your arms ready. Let's go. So squat, punch it up. Squat, up. Squat it down. Make sure you're breathing. Don't hold your breath. Give me 30 more seconds. Whew. 
One more. All right. Drop your weight. Next station is coming down onto a plank. You can hold it there or you can do plank then elbows. Your choice. Let's get into position and let's go. If for shoulder reasons, you want to keep it here, things that I want you to focus on, I don't want your tush way up here. Keep it tucked. Keep your head in line with the rest of your body. Your feet, you want them to be about hip distance apart. You don't want them to be right on top of each other. So hip distance apart. Tuck your tush. Give me 15 more seconds. All right, let's bring it back to center. Whew. Next is our arm circle. If you can, if you started with the right arm, let's start with the left arm. So one is going forward, and then the other is going backwards. So working on that coordination. If it feels more comfortable, you can do thumb up, or you can have thumb pointing straight ahead. Give me, we got 30 more seconds. You can vary up the speed, so you can slow it down, make it a little bit bigger, or you can tighten it up and make it faster. Give me 10 more seconds. And relax it down. If you need to, grab a sip of water. All right, so next station, we're doing our marches. Our arms are coming in and out. All right, let's get started. I'm just gonna show you. So this is what your arms are doing here. I'm just gonna show you a variation. So you can be marching, flipping your hands. Open, close, open, close. If your shoulders are feeling like they are tired, and it is hard to keep your elbows up and in good form. That's something you could do if you want to keep weights. Or you can be here without weights. We're almost there. All right, relax it down. Next, we're doing a tricep kickback with a side step or a side tap. You can do both or you can just do one. Let's go. So tap. Working on really Engaging the back parts of your shoulders and your arms. Trying not to use momentum. Give 
Give me 30 more seconds. Let's do one more. All right, put our weights down. Next are our cross punches. I want you to have a target on each end that you're working towards, so that way you're really getting some nice rotation and movement. All right, let's get started now. Give me 30 more seconds. Finish strong. One more. All right, grab one weight. Next is putting away the dishes. So if we did, if you were coming down to your left and going up to the right, let's switch diagonals. All right, so getting your feet about hip distance apart. Let's go, so you're reaching it down. Put away the dish. Okay, 30 seconds in, 30 seconds to go. All right, bring that weight down. You're grabbing your other weight. And this one, we're gonna bring our arms out to the side. You can do a toe tap or a lift or a side step. All right, let's get going now. So you're lifting, bringing it to center. Really trying not to use momentum. Twenty five seconds left. Whoo! All right, put your weights down. We got one more station to go. Keep your feet moving if you can. We're doing hooks next. I'm gonna call it out. 
either right or left. All right, get your body in position. Stand tall, let's go. Right, right, left, 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 right, right, left, 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 right, 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 left, right, left, 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 right. Right, right, left, right, left, right, 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 left, left, right, 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 left, right, 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 left, left, right, right, left, right. Right, right, left, right, left. All right, woo! All right, you're done with stations. Grab a sip of water. Woo! but we're not done with the weight yet. So we're gonna work on standing balance. So we're gonna work on standing on one leg. And just like last week, how we did with the scarf, we're gonna work on swinging that weight. If you need to, you can hold onto a chair, a wall. All right, we're gonna get going. So you want to make sure that you're standing tall, you're keeping your glute engaged on that standing leg. And switch sides. So shift over, engage your standing legs, stand tall. And then when you're ready, So the weight's given a little bit of momentum, which is making our standing leg work harder. And bring it down. And let's switch sides again. Let's do one more time on each leg. So engaging your tush, standing tall. And step down, we're gonna switch. So engage your glutes, stand tall, and then let's go. All right, let's put that weight down. Okay. From here, let's work on just standing heel to toe. We're gonna work on stepping forward, 
bringing it back forward bring it back One more. Okay, let's switch our feet. So now we're stepping forward and back with the opposite foot. Trying to keep your trunk up tall. Trying not to rotate too much. The closer you get to heel to toe, the more challenging this exercise is. Let's do one more. We're gonna switch sides again. So each side gets two opportunities. And then let's switch. All right. Nice job. We're gonna do one more balance exercise. This one you're gonna hold on to a chair, a wall, the kitchen counter if you're in the kitchen. And we're gonna plant one foot. And what we're gonna do is you're gonna be lifting your back leg, reaching down to the floor, pull back up. So you're squeezing your tush. We're gonna do five on the right, five on the left, two rounds. Let's go. So you're reaching down, pulling through your core, that's one. And back up, that's two. Three. Four. And five. All right, let's get in position. We're going to do the opposite side. So get your leg back, engage your glute, and you're reaching down. That's one, two, three, four. And five. We're gonna do one more round on each side. So engaging your standing leg, reaching your opposite leg back. Let's reach it down. One, two, three. four, and five. Let's switch sides one more, and then we'll do our cool down. So let's reach it. One, two, trying to keep your spine in a really neutral position. Three, four, Give me one more, five. All right. All right, so let's get in the position for our cool down. So let's bring one leg forward into a lunge. You're opening up your hip, getting your back 
heel down to the floor, standing tall, getting some nice deep breaths. And let's do one more breath. And let's bring that in, drop our hips back, toe up towards the ceiling, getting some nice hamstring stretches. And drop it down, roll up. Let's do the other side. Oop, forward lunge, opening up that hip, getting your heel down to the floor, standing tall. And let's bring it in. Drop our hips back, toe up towards the ceiling. And let's bring that down. Reach your arm across, stretch out your shoulder. And then you can even add in a side bend stretch for your neck. Bring it down, shake those shoulders out a little. Reach across with your other arm. Shake it out. And if this feels comfortable, reach back like you're giving yourself a back scratch. And bring it down. Let's do the other side. Bring it down. Let's grab a seat in our chair. So bringing our foot up and across, opening up our hip, getting some nice stretching. And you can lean forward if that feels more comfortable. If this doesn't feel comfortable for your hip, you can always prop up a stool. And bring it down, let's switch sides. and bring it down. Let's get our feet apart and we're gonna twist, getting your shoulder going, pointing down to the floor. Bring it up, other side. And up. And up. Do one more on each side. All right. Next, let's bring a side bend over, really stretching through our side, reaching. And then if you want, reach up for the ceiling, open up through your shoulder and come back to that side bend. Float your arm down, let's do the other side. 
So reach it over, really stretching through your side. And then open up, looking up at the ceiling. And then bring it back to the side. Bring it down. And then let's just finish with a couple deep breaths. So breathe in, arms are up, float it down. Three more, breathe in. Let's do one more. All right, nice job everyone. Woo!